It's time for another Days Gone Adventure by Grey Ghost Gamers. In this gameplay, he's decided to take on the old sawmill horde, but with a twist. No guns, just his wits and a bunch of throwable items that go boom. Sounds insane, right? It's too many. It's too many. Well, get comfy because GG is about to walk you through his epic adrenaline pumping attempt to conquer this horde from three stealthy spots that may surprise you. Ever thought about this one? Let's watch GG give it a whirl. you notice that GG is particularly macabre? Or is it masochistic? To just watch freakers burn and listen to their final agonizing screams? Huh. Was that nuts enough for you? Well, don't get too comfortable, okay? Because this next location is essentially putting the horde in a blind spot, and all GG has got going for him is the radar. In case you're wondering, the traps are there to warn for the eventual Freaker ambush.
Ah, shit, four of them. Wild enough for you? Blood pumping and you're just so glad it's not you working this? How about giving a show of support for Gigi by hitting that subscribe button, yeah? It'll only take a sec, and just maybe, Gigi will write my ticket off this merry-go-round and do the damn voicing himself for a change. More bounties. Finally, let's crank the difficulty up a notch to round this out. Not only is Gigi attacking this horde mere feet from where they'll be sleeping, but that small boarded up window opening is the make or break of this attempt. One missed toss and the jig will be up.
god! I gotta admit, those three stealthy spots give camping a whole new meaning. Don't forget to give this video a huge like. It just might mean the difference if me, Russell, your AI avatar still has a job or not after this. Grey Ghost Gamers is a twitchy dude and can't guarantee my existence. Be sure to check out the next Days Gone video though.